welcome back to my channel. I'm Millie, if you don't already know me. And in today's video, I will be taking you guys along with what I pack in my bag for Adelaide. So I'm flying from Sydney to Adelaide tomorrow. Oh my gosh, tomorrow. For the National Open Water. I'm definitely racing the relay team. But I have a shoulder injury, so I don't know if I will be racing the 5K. It will really just depend on how I'm feeling in warm-up. So I'm kind of cutting it close. I've only had 23 days of semi-normal training. I've been to Adelaide before for this event. I love it every time I go. It has the best atmosphere and I always have such a great time. So I'm so excited to go. Can you hear that? My mum's vacuuming. Okay, so let's get started. I use a list it keeps me organized so I definitely recommend you guys writing yourself a list or I'll pop my list over here so you can use it as a guide and another thing is definitely pack the night before it takes so much pressure off on race day because once I didn't go off my list and I also packed the morning before my race and what do you know I forgot my race suits Anyone that is a swimmer knows that is a big no-no. Mum was not happy at all. Just letting you know, that was not my best day of racing. Probably one of the worst. It was not my finest. But lucky it wasn't a main carnival, so it didn't really matter. Okay, so I've laid everything I need out on the bed. First, obviously, a bag. I use my Engine Maroon bag. I love the matchy matchy. So, first, two towels, but I'm taking three because they're thin and light for packing and they dry really fast. Next, caps. I'm taking like. Oh, there's a red one. I guess we don't want that one. I'm taking heaps because I've never ripped a cap in all my life but last week i ripped three in one week so i'm being really cautious and packing like six i think it was my nails which i had to get cut down but they're still not short enough next goggles i use clear goggles and i put contacts underneath i don't usually wear contacts in the water but i do at open water i just try my best to keep my eyes dry and obviously hope for the best Next, I use these prescription goggles, which I love to hate. I love them because I can see, obviously, which is a must. And I hate them because they are so ugly and I feel like the nerd on the pool deck. And I know every time I step onto the blocks, you feel really intimidated. And I'm like, huh? And then you're like, oh, must watch out for her. Anyway, I feel really cute in these. I don't like to wear them to the beach though, because you know, all the hotties at Canola. These ain't gonna get the gas, if you know what I mean. Spare swimmers, I put one in my race bag and one in carry on. Two race suits. These are what I wear when I'm racing. I know a lot of people use the long ones for open water racing, but I just prefer to use the short ones. And these are okay for me for now. Next, earplugs. Because every time I step foot into the water, I get an ear infection. Skipping rope. Theraband. Roller, which I use for stretching. I know a lot of people prefer to get the fancy massage, but that is just not for me. I prefer to roll out, which does take a lot more time and patience. I find it just as beneficial and it also saves so much time. It also saves so much money. Roller save money. Next is fins for warming up and also warming down. 
or as Joshua would say, cooling down. Sorry, big debate about that one. Esky sunscreen, Clarentine, just in case the stingers are bad. Voltaren for my shoulder, just in case it hurts. Okay, there we go. Okay, there we go. There is my race bag packed. And just a quick tip when flying with your bag, make sure you take your race bag as carry-on because this is the most important bag and you do not want it to go missing. So always have it with you so you know it's safe. Okay, next, let's get packing for my normal bag. I don't need that much. So I'm just taking the basics. Starting with club gear. I have so much club gear. Shirts, singlets, jackets, black shorts, and tights as well. Training cozies and pretty cozies, I'll say. Two hats, undies, socks, bras, Australia Day gear, which is an essential because I love Australia Day. Probably one of my favorite days of the year. So that's definitely coming. Steve-O's there too. We love Steve-O. A denim jacket to go with this outfit if it's cold, which is the going out outfit. This is for when I'm going home or just another outfit for when I'm there. My pajamas. Lastly, my shoes. I have these runners, these going out shoes, which aren't really going out, they're very basic. That will go with this outfit. And then just some sandals, which I probably wear around most of the time. And then some binoculars for mum. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So let's pack the bag. Okay, so for toiletries, I have got a lot of stuff. So I'm packing makeup wipe, toothpaste, toothbrush, facial scrub, facial cleanser, prescribed acne medication, Moisturizer, for makeup I brought foundation, concealer, prep and prime, eyebrow brush, blush, mascara, lip balm, deodorant. Okay, and then for hair care, shampoo. I like to use these travel ones, they're so much easier. And conditioner, treatment, another treatment. This is for me and my mum as well, so it's not like all of this just for me. Another treatment, because I prefer this one, she prefers that one. You know how it is. Hairbrush and hair ties. Contacts. Oh my gosh, contacts are a must. And my glasses. If I do not bring contacts and glasses, oh my god, it's not good. Once I forgot my glasses. That was the worst ever. Like, not having glasses, not being able to see gives me anxiety. Don't forget them. <laughs> they are in. Okay, there we go. My bags are packed. Finally. But I do feel so much less stressed and more organized because I'm leaving tomorrow. So I will catch up with you guys at the airport. Okay, we're at the airport in the waiting room in the business lounge, I shall say, as you can see. <laughs> Just a prank. We fly economy. <laughs> it's a video. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Okay, we're getting on now. Let's get it. Gonna be real cute. Boarding! <laughs> Boarding. Oh my god, sexy mama. Does anyone else like to make themselves look like it's actually?
actually good for a fly. Anyone else curl the hair? Good makeup on. Hey Dad. Say hi to the vlog. <laughs> Dad's loving it. Loving it. I feel really awkward talking because the plane is so quiet. Get into your water guys. later and I'm just editing the video now and I just realized that I completely forgot to do an outro whoopsie I guess just being in Adelaide got the better of me but anyway I hope you guys that fly anyway I hope you guys like this video give it a big thumbs up if you did if you want to see what actually happened in Adelaide that'll be my next video make sure you like this video subscribe and click the notification bell what is that flight doing for my next video? See you next Sunday. Bye.